Wash bomb! No, just kidding, this isn't wash, this isn't even basketball. This is Travis Green. Earlier today on Sportsnet, Ian McIntyre published an article. It's a Q&A of Travis Green, and the questions are based around the Vancouver Canucks and the team going into next year talking about things like the free agent acquisitions, Besser, and everything, but the most important part of this Q&A, in my opinion at least, after reading it, was the Louis Erickson stuff that shows up at the end. I think everybody is going to be wanting to hear this. So, the interview goes, it's just normal, talking about the free agent signings, Green is talking about how the team can get better, how they need to get better, and how they're capable of getting better. Then eventually, the discussion shifts over to Brock Besser and how he's going to get a new contract. And the question actually says this. When Besser signs, it will be for a big number, which makes Ericsson's 6 million cap hit more onerous. Now, just in case you didn't know, onerous is defined as involving an amount of effort and difficulty that is oppressively burdensome. So inconvenient, troublesome put any of those words into this question. Were you surprised by what Louis Erickson said at the Worlds? Then Green says, what did he say, that we didn't have trust and see eye to eye? Sportsnet corrects him, that you didn't get along 100% and that you don't trust him the way his previous coaches did. Green says this, I was surprised that it came out publicly, but I'm not surprised that he isn't happy about certain things. Players are proud. They want to play well and want to have individual success. I understand Louis hasn't scored as much as he wanted to and maybe played at times as much as he wanted to. I understand that and we've discussed that. But it happens a lot in the NHL. I like to think I have an open door policy and try to be as honest with players as I can. Louis and I have talked about his play and I know he's frustrated. Sportsnet asks Green, have you talked to him about what he said? Green says he hasn't. Then, Sportsnet asks the big question here, which is replied with the very meaty answer. Sportsnet asks Travis Green, Room for Louis under the salary cap is one issue, but is there still room for him on your team? To which Green replies, Louis, I respect his career. I know he wants to probably play better than he has and have more success for himself but I still have a job to do, and my job is to put the best team on the ice and play guys I see fit, and not just based on salaries. I want players who will do anything in their power to help the Canucks win. That's all they care about, being a Canuck and helping us win. With the additions of some forwards, we've got some tough decisions to make, and he's no different than any other players coming into camp. So, this is a big answer. This is not just the stereotypical, Louis does the little things, he's good on the PK, he's good defensively, he's a good leader, he's a good mentor. This is straight up, balls to the walls, Louis is not going to get any special treatment just because he's getting paid $6 million. This is Travis Green saying, that he wants players who will help the Canucks win and who want the Canucks to win, not just based on salary. And I think the implications with this are huge because this just spells a further narrative for Louis Erickson that if he wants to keep up with the Vancouver Canucks, and don't worry, we've made a ton of videos about Erickson, potential trade offers, and updating this story as it goes on, even talking about what if he actually stays, Erickson is going to need to work if he stays with the Canucks. Because if he doesn't, Green said it outright, he's not going to be given any rewards for just moping around anymore. And I'm so interested into looking forward into what happens next, because we all know the story, we all know that he's not been the best player that he could have been these past few years, and we all know that things haven't necessarily been the best. So, for Travis Green to come out and acknowledge that, and lay the cards out on the table in the Sportsnet Q&A, it's very intriguing. Very, very intriguing. Hope you enjoyed this video. So, 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 so
and bye.